Sam Hatcher spends his days here on the fourth floor for the Hatfield McCoy Museum. He says right now, there's a new wrinkle that may have developed he wants to let people know about that is a Hatfield McCoy unknown until this point. Of the many displays at the museum, the Hatfield McCoy section is both the largest and draws the biggest crowds. But history isn't the only thing on Sam's mind when it comes to the two infamous families. According to records filmed by Hatcher earlier this year, Randolph McCoy had at least one marriage that has been lost to history until now. Found on Ancestry.com this uh, marriage certificate. We got two part here: is the mar marriage license, and then down here is the marriage certificate that is uh, for what is filed at the clerk's office. Hatcher spent a great deal of his time digging into census records to reveal Randolph McCoy's last marriage. Uh, apparently Randolph McCoy, Randolph McCoy married in 1899 a Hattie Steffi. Randolph McCoy was 73, Hattie was 17. This discovery is news for even the most expert followers of the Hatfield McCoy saga. They uh, apparently married in 1899. At some point they separated before the 1900 census. They apparently got back together for a while, in which they did have one child, I believe a girl. Now, they were later divorced. The museum is open on Monday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday from 10 in the morning until 4 in the afternoon, and on Tuesday and Wednesdays by appointment. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Sheldon Cumpton.